Make sure you like and subscribe to keep our master happy and the videos coming. Hello humans and welcome to the Cartridge and Disc Podcast. Today we're going to talk about video games. That's right, video games. And let's see how, how much we got these for. Here we go. Tribes of Midgard. It was $14.99. Let's see how much I got it for. Next, a brand new copy of the Callisto Protocol. Day 1 edition for the PS5. Alright, so that's two PS5 titles. Another PS5 title. Star Ocean, the D Divine Force PS5 title. You know, it's just a little light. I'm feeling a little light on the P on the PlayStation um, video game. So I decided to get some. Here we go. Another one. Uh, Rift Breaker for the PS5. And I got a couple of PS4 titles. One of them, they gave me the wrong one. But um, it's a far point for the VR. Right. And last but not least, it's a game called Foreclosure for the PS4. All right. So that's what I got. What do you guys think I paid for that? I'll let you, I'll give you five seconds to think about it. One, two, three, four, five. About 10 bucks a piece. Look at that. With my discount, with everything else, with the BOGO, they average to be $10 a piece. That's pretty good. Now, what I'm going to show you here, and this is one of the tricks of the trade for me, guys. This is what I do. Is I ask them to print a list because, you know, when they see me coming in, they know that I'm gonna take a while, right? But for me, it's very important to have a list because then I can just, uh, you know, scan through it, see what my selections are gonna be, and then just let the employees work, see if they can find that stuff for me. Uh, you know, the only caveat that I have for them is that they have to be in their original boxes. I don't want any of this replacement box shit. I don't want any of this, uh, you know, just a cartridge on its own. Um, you know, that's, that's what I'm looking for. You can get some pretty good deals here, but let me just show you a couple of them here for, um, the Somnium files. There's a couple of switch titles here, uh, switch, um, Somnium files right now they are 59 and 49. So that's for the BOGO and 34 and 39 used, All right? There's a lot of switch games here. Um, you know, some of them are duds, like, are you smarter than a fifth grader? But there's Xbox series X. Let's look at some of the titles. The um, Atari 50, right, is on BOGO, and it's uh, $37.99 used. Um, Balan Wonderworld, nobody wants that game. <laughs> it's $14.99, right? Um, let's see, Switch titles, Switch titles. Civilization, Cobra Kai is out there, um, Cobra Kai 2. For the Xbox Series X, uh, Black Ops, Cold War, uh, Dark Pictures, The Devil and Me. And uh, DC's Justice League, Justice League comic. PS5, Deathloop. Deathloop you can buy for $14.99 used, believe it or not. That's a great game for $14.99, guys. I wouldn't pass it up. The Diofield Chronicles, $27.99. $29.99 brand new. All right, that's pretty cool. Uh, Dragon Ball Z, uh, Kakarot for the Switch. You can get for $34.99. Again, on BOGO, it would be half price if you find something that's matching. Um, look at this. Far Cry Ultimate uh, Game Edition. Exclusive BOGO. Um, <laughs> look at this. Brand new. It's 109 used. $6.99. What? <laughs> Fallout 76, the same thing. Used $6.99. Oh, man. Let me tell you. But The Evil Dead is on BOGO. If you've you know, if you guys like that title. And then I just keep on switching for, looking for Switch and PS5 titles for me. I mean, that's really what I look for. Gotham Knights is up there on the BOGO uh, for the Switch. We have JoJo. Uh, you know, if you're into JoJo, I mean, that's that's a pretty good title. Uh, just Die Already is up there on the Switch. Live Alive. Live Alive. Um, B1G BOGO. I mean, shoot, you can't go wrong with that one. That's a good game. I, uh, you know, I bought it. Let's see here. Madden 23 is actually pretty cheap. $24.99 on the Xbox Series X. The Midnight Suns, um, you know, you can get the, the, uh, the regular edition for $29.99 used, right? Maximum football is $8.99. Let's see here. Xbox Series X titles. Mortal Kombat 11, you can get for $24.99. And uh, NBA 2K, $9.99, used, right? Uh, here's a good one for the PS4. 
Aneo, the, the world ends with you. Now, these are titles that that they have. I'm going to go back um, when I get a chance and, and, you know, pick a couple of these up. Because some of these, you know, I just uh, I just didn't see them at the moment. I had to go back to to work. But they have like No Man's Sky. That's a title that I would only buy <laughs> on sale, right? Um, but uh, I think the Switch version was like twenty four ninety nine or something like that. Anyway, uh, No More Heroes three, um, nineteen ninety nine used on Bogo. Um, Let's see what else. Outriders, you know that game's dead now, but I mean you can get it for six ninety nine. You know, just play the story mode. Um, Xbox Series X, PGA, um, Plague Tale Requiem for the PS five. Let's see what else. Uh, Prini NIS Classics Volume three forty four ninety nine on the Switch, and Prini Presents thirty four ninety nine on the Switch. A uh, Rage two six ninety nine. You know, I mean. You have nothing else to do, right? Uh, Saints Row, twenty-seven ninety-nine. You can get out there. Uh, this is one that I'm going to go back for, and that's Scarlet Nexus on the Bogo, twelve ninety-nine. That's a decent game, man, and it's even nine ninety-nine on the PS4 if you can't get it there. Um, let's see what else. Soul Hackers Two is twenty-four ninety-nine. Uh, if you're an Atlas fan, uh, Star Ocean: The Divine Force, uh, twenty-nine ninety-nine, and I got it on the Bogo, so I got that half price. Um, and it's also available for the Xbox Series X and uh, Strangers in Paradise, uh, Stranger in Paradise. I'm sorry, Final Fantasy, twenty nine ninety nine used on Bogo for the Xbox, and also for the PlayStation. It's at thirty four ninety nine, um, five dollars more. Uh, Sword Art Online um, is fourteen ninety nine on the Xbox One and the PS four. Right, Tales of, Tales of Arise, eighteen ninety nine used. But new on the PS4 is $19.99. So, I mean, that's a better deal, right? And uh, those are the kind of things that are out there now in this store. Remember, these are per store, right? So your store might be having something completely different, guys. And um, if you're going to be collecting uh, in mass, uh, and not necessarily these games, guys. Let, let's say you just collect Switch or you just like physical media. Uh, they'll go in there, and if they have anything from 7th Gen, they will print it out for you. And uh, I found this to be more efficient. I just go in there, I tell them what I want, and after I go there two or three times, the guys already know. You know, by the time I come in, uh, sometimes stuff comes in, and they already set it aside because they know that that's the kind of stuff I'll buy, and they'll just hand it over, you know, so... Just build relationships, guys. Use these forms to be more efficient if you want to shop quicker. And that way you, you'll know what they have and you can pick it out right away. Anyway, guys, that's a little bit of game hoarding. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. And I will catch you on the next one. I have more writings coming up this weekend. Um, I have tons of ideas for videos. What I need is actual time and maybe some sleep. <laughs> But I, I will be putting more content out, more retro content and, um, you know, some current events. Thank you so much for watching my channel. I do appreciate it. I will catch you on the next one. Take care. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I earned your subscription. Make sure to hit that like button. And if you'd like to, please subscribe. I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.